Bully fam, bully fam, what it do? TBK West back with another video. And today, we are going to check out my boy's bullies. Uh, my boy Curry, it's a friend of mine. We've been friends since about, what, 2009, I believe. So him and his son, they both uh, have been breeding exotic bullies. So we're going to go take a closer look at my man's kennel. You know what I'm saying? It's about a good 30-minute drive. You know, he up there in the big old rich houses so we're gonna go check them out man all right y'all stay tuned man and later in this video i'm gonna do a little i'm gonna be grinding up some raw for the dog oh shit i forgot to i tell my son to take it out the freezer right now the deep freezer i'm gonna uh, be grinding up some raw man we'll be giving landlord some of that good raw raw I'm gonna do an experiment. I'm gonna give him nothing but raw only for, let's say what, two weeks, a month? Yeah, something to that nature, cause my boy uh, Jason over at Shackle Broken Kennels, man, he had this dog that I had bought from him. And he initially showed it to me and I was like, that's a good dog. But I don't know how much time passed. I think, excuse me, I think it was like two months. Two months went by, right? And this dog came back looking like it was on steroids, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and uh, I asked him, like, bro, what was the recipe? How you do this and that? He was like, man, straight raw, straight raw. I was like, no kibble at all? He was like, nah, no kibble. So, let's do a little experiment. I got a nice amount of chicken in the deep freezer, so. Do an experiment with my boy landlord, man. Y'all stay tuned for that, but uh, yeah, man. Let me get to the house, man. To yes, sir. Y'all check out Mercedes right here. Yeah, man. We over here at the 3D's Bully Kennel. Y'all see, she got some puppies on the ground. These are Chucky kids. And my boy went with the Mercedes Times Chucky. Look at these beautiful pups. Look at that, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at this dude. Man. A1. A1. Straight tail. Beautiful, exotic. And also, uh, this is a cash granddaughter, right? Cash daughter. No, cash daughter, my bad. This is a direct cash daughter. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Here with my boy Davion. Oh, yeah. What do do? Yeah, man. This is my boy Curry's son. He out here doing his thing with these bullies, man. He got some, some hot shit coming. Y'all stay tuned, man. You know what I'm saying? A lot of good breeds on the way. Sir, 3D's Nutrition Shack. It's my boy Curry Shop, man. We about to go get a, uh, some nutrition real quick. All right, so. <laughs> All right, y'all, we in the 3D Nutrition Shack, man. And uh, about to get me some uh, 
something nice and lovely and healthy, y'all. So, I'm trying to think, man. We're going to see. Let's check her out. Let's check them out. Yes, yes. Like I said, y'all follow on Instagram and Facebook. 3D Nutrition Shack, man. You know what I'm saying? Only the best. Only the best. Perfect. <laughs> so, yeah, y'all. This is the owner right here, y'all. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, y'all go ahead and support, man. Y'all come through. You know, they got Wi-Fi. You know, it's a nice lounge. You know, get you something you can see. Got immune boost, got probiotics, got, you know. Yeah, man, health is wealth. Y'all see it, we got the specialty. This is special on the house mix right here, the blackberry lemonade. You, know what I'm you gotta know the owners to get this one. And then we got this wonderful chocolate chip cookie dough shake with all types of wonderful stuff inside that's, you know, healthy for the body, you know, give you energy. I, I can't recall everything. What was it, aloe? Uh, aloe, jacin, and black green, and aguam tea. Yes, sir. I'll stop by when y'all in town. All right, as y'all can see, I got the grinder right here. And I just chopped these leg quarters up just a little bit because, you know, my hole is kind of small right here. Pause. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of small uh, based on this grinder right here. Um, pulled this bad boy out a long time ago. I've been using it ever since. Um, I think I had it for like three, four months or something like that. Um, but it was like 250 on Amazon. And uh, it still worked, man. Do what it's supposed to do. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just uh, grind some of this uh, chicken up right here. This is only like 10 pounds or something like that, but I got a lot more in the freezer and uh, I ain't gonna have to make y'all watch me uh, grind all that chicken up. So just for uh, video purposes, I'm gonna show y'all that I'm about to conduct my experiment. And we're gonna do the landlord. We're gonna do raw only, no kibble. And I might sprinkle, you know, some origins on there. Possibly, maybe. I'm gonna add like organs and gizzards and stuff like that. So, yeah, y'all, just the little containers. I got these from HEB. I seen them at Walmart too. They hold probably like five pounds. I'm, gonna, I'm only gonna do like two pounds a day or something like that. But, yeah, y'all, let's see, man. I'm gonna show y'all the results after like what? A month? Yeah, let's see a month. All right, let's get, let's get to it. Uh, yeah, y'all, make sure y'all weigh this out so uh, you can weigh how much meat that you put in these containers. All right, y'all, now remember, you do not have to do this grinding part if you got some straight savages. You know, if you got so your dogs are straight savages and they just kill everything you lay down, you do not have to do this. This is mainly just for, like, picky eaters, you know what I'm saying? But um, also, um, you know, it's also dangerous, you know, a bone could get caught in the jaw, cause an infection, abscess, all that type of stuff too. So it's also safer to grind it up. This is the last of it right here, y'all. I'm gonna wrap this up. Alright.
figure out what I'm gonna call these two. Alright, so. This dude, I don't know yet. Uh, what y'all think I should call him? Ghost? I think I should call him Ghost or. Or, uh. I think I should call him Ghost or Devo. What y'all think, man? Let me know in the comments, man. Ghost or Devo? For her, I'm gonna name her Victory. Her name is gonna be Victory, y'all. Yeah. TBK Victory. Y'all see that? Beautiful. So I don't know if that's gonna be Ghost or Debo. I think I'm gonna go with Ghost. What y'all think, man? Ghost and Victory, aka Victoria, TBK, Ghost. Yeah, y'all. They were sleep, man. I just woke them up real quick for the video, but y'all see they playful. Yes, sir. Appreciate y'all for tapping in, man. It's TBK West. I'm out of here. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And this is my boy TBK Ghost with a TBK Victory signing out. We out of here, man. Peace.